Hello everyone, this is Alicia from WorkersOnBoard.com. I just found out about a work from home job that will pay you $10 per minute to add subtitles to movie trailers. I'm going to tell you about that and then there's another company that needs people to watch videos and listen to audio files and you're going to add captions to that. They need you to start immediately and you will work 20 to 40 hours a week. If you're new to this channel, feel free to subscribe. If you've just been watching my videos, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up for all the content that I'm sharing with you guys. I really appreciate it so much. I am a little bit under the weather, so my voice is a little bit raspy, but thank you all so much for taking the time to watch this video. I want to let you know that you can join our group too. And you can get access to more work from home jobs. Now, I did post additional jobs today for you all, for the members. And you can sign up today. And um, it's a group that has exclusive bonus content. There are digital downloads you can you utilize in your work from home job journey. As well as there's recipes and there's tips and advice to help you not only get a job, keep a job, and even get a raise. So, so many more, so much more content and bonus information that you can get access to if you join. So, if you have any questions about that, just make sure you leave me a comment right below this video. There's a job application tracker spreadsheet too that I want to let you all know about because it's a really easy way for you to keep track with all of your jobs, the companies that you've applied to, any offers you have. And I'm going to show you really quickly how it works. So it's in Google Sheets. It's a spreadsheet that I made and laid out for you all. And it's really, really nice and easy to use. And so you can come in and edit the dates, of course. it's not to, That's not today's date, but you can come in and edit that. And so there's a calendar already embedded. So you're just going to click through and you're going to go through and follow all of the steps. So it's as easy as typing and you're just going to tab over to the next section and then you can do that. Your application status you can put here. You're going to apply. You can put the link to the website here, contact name, email, phone number. Then after you do that, there's a section here where you, of course, put the date in again. The company and then you can select the outcome you're waiting testing first interview and so much more and then what you're going to do is a follow-up for the next step so um, you can actually pick up this job application tracker spreadsheet it's just going to help you to be more organized and stay on top of the jobs so that you will not miss out on any opportunities and that You'll know what steps to take next and who you've already applied to and who you're waiting to hear back from. And it's just going to help you be more efficient in your job search. So if you have any questions about that, make sure you leave me a comment right below this video. So the job I wanted to share with you all <clears throat> comes from a company I don't think I've shared here before. The name of this company is called Word Bank and they have a lot a, a lot of non phone job opportunities and this one is for a freelance subtitler so they have they work with a well-known streaming service that they've contracted with and they need people to provide these subtitling services for their theatrical trailers and digital banners and artwork and all of that so um, I'm not really sure who that known streaming service could be but what you're going to do is you're going to you're going to your job is going to be to subtitle and translate those full trailers teasers and cut downs you will also translate actor dialogue in a trailer and this is just using a free software that's going to help you to be able to do that and you're also going to translate and localize on-screen text provided in a google sheet and translate <clears throat> excuse me force narratives on screen as well as um, key artwork and print digital banners provided in a Google sheet 
and then you're going to um, edit all of your work and just make sure um, everything's accurate. So the fee, the pay they're going to give you, excuse me one second. Okay, I'm back. So the pay for that is $10 a minute for QA review. And then you'll get 10 cents per word for doing that. 15 cents per word for translation. $10 per minute for subtitling. So um, they need people to do this right now. They do pay through wire wise to transfer um, payments bank transfers also available if wise is unavailable in your country so they're hiring worldwide you do need to have five or more years subtitling experience and be native speakers <clears throat> excuse me of your target language and be able to complete your work within 24 hours and for this job, they want you to be able to work a minimum of two titles per week. So if you're interested, make sure you apply online. And I'll leave the link to that right below this video. Also, there's another job for caption creators. It comes from DataForce. This is another company that has non-phone freelance work from home jobs in several countries. And so they need people to actually listen to audio files and provide a detailed description of the content. You will also watch the video and then um, update the original description if it needs to be updated. Again, they stress, watch the video again and update the description by adding in all visual elements if you need to. So this job does not require any experience at all. Training is going to be provided but they want you to be a native English speaker, live in the U.S., can meet daily data requirements, have excellent written communication, strong reading and comprehension, good time management, and then you need to complete a transcription test before you can begin working. So um, again, it's an English transcription test. And so if you're interested in this, make sure you apply online. I'm not sure. How much the pay is you will have weekends off but they need people to start right away working 20 to 40 hours a week and if that job does not interest you you can always go back and look at their other job openings to see what else they have available I also put brand new work at home jobs on the weekly job excuse me Friday well weekly job page too you can go there and then Friday freebie page today for virtual assistance to work from home and then for an operations associate for Morty. And then you can just scroll down and look through all of the other jobs from GE and so many more that you can apply to online. This is a non-phone entry level job too um, for community support specialists. But you can come here and check out some of the jobs. And you can also listen to my podcast where there's some work from home jobs that I share there with you all that I don't share anywhere else online so thank you so much for watching this video again um, please feel free to apply to any of the jobs that you see that you're interested in and if you're looking for even more work from home jobs make sure you come back on Monday to workersonboard.com to the weekly job page for even more work from home job leads from real companies hiring people to work right out of their home office Thank you so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day and weekend and make sure you check out for my next video.